Hello everyone, welcome to our channel. So today in this tutorial, I'm going to show you how do you edit footer in MailChimp. So let's get into the video. Firstly, open up MailChimp. So go to your browser, open up MailChimp, right? And go to your website and then open up, uh, log into your account. So it's easier if you, if you have an, if you have an account and log in. So if you need, if you don't have an account, then if you need help with uh, creating an account, we've got a separate video on our channel on it and you can have a look at it. So here, so I see we already have an account. So log into your account. Once you have logged into your account, so let's create a footer. Uh, so what we can do, just click on create. So let's create something. So click on uh, probably regular email. That's enough just for demo. Click on regular. All right. And then once this loads, choose any builder here. So for, for example, like classic is fine for this videos here. So just choose a classic and then now just um, choose a layout or template whatever that suits you. So for example, let me use a template, which is easier. So I'll just use probably this one here. That's fine. So I'll just click on it. So now, okay, I'm going to open up a template. So it's just all over. It's just opening up. So once it loads, then um, I should be able to edit my footer. So as you know, this is their header. So if I scroll down and go to my footer here, so this is my footer. So if you want to edit it, just click on the pen icon here. All right, and then there you go. So you have the stuff here. So you can you do any editing you want. You can change whatever you want here. We want to add some graphics or picture to it. You can these options here. So you can these are the toolbars here. So like how as in a Microsoft Word, so where you can do all your editing and stuff. So that's it. So you can choose, do whatever uh, edit that needs to be done. You can just do it and then hit on the save and close option, and that's it. That will be saved, and that's pretty much it. Is hope this video is helpful. I will see you guys in another video. Thank you.